At the peak of her career, Huang jong un was receiving love for her great performances, but now she's making headlines for attempting to divorce her husband for the second time. What exactly is the story behind her rocky relationship with the man she spent eight years of her life with and who is at fault? It's messy, so let's get into it. jong un tied the knot to Lee young don back in 2016 after only six months of publicly dating. He's currently a businessman, but he used to be a professional golfer, which definitely got him bonus points with the ladies. When they went public with their relationship in December of 2015, it turned quite a few heads. Netizens were surprised that they weren't afraid to show off their love by not hiding any skinship or affection, not to mention that people thought it was bold to get married after only half a year of being together. Later on, it was revealed that they had actually been dating for 10 months prior to their wedding, which is still not a lot of time for most couples to figure out whether they want to live together for the rest of their lives. The two officially got married in 2016 and had their first child over a year later. As you can see, they navigated their relationship very fast. People were especially surprised by the speed they were going at because jong Um had just gotten out of a long-term relationship. Before she and young Don got together, she was dating musician Kim yong jun They became the first real couple to appear on We Got Married, which was an incredibly popular variety show. The two made their relationship public in 2006 and dated for nine years. It wasn't without problems, though, because this relationship was also extremely rocky. The two broke up and made up several times, which definitely raised a lot of eyebrows. jong Um spoke up about their dynamic and revealed, even if we do end up breaking up, it doesn't go on for more than a week. If one person doesn't call, then the other person ends up calling. Although this was normal for them, it wasn't a good look for jong Um at all. They almost broke up for good when jong Um starred in High Kick Through the Roof. There were rumors going around that she was seeing her co-star Daniel Choi. Young Jun couldn't handle the rumors or the fact that they had kissing scenes together, so they had a big fight and decided to break up. Of course, they came back to each other without a clear plan for the future. jong Um dished a little more on their relationship and shared, when are we getting married? We say that to each other and think that if we do decide to marry, then we do it. And if we end up breaking up, we break up. Marriage wasn't in the cards for them because they officially broke up in 2015, and it didn't take jong Um that long to move on to her next lover. She wasn't only gaining negative publicity for her love life, though, because she was also having serious issues with her colleagues. Before jong Um was an actress, she debuted as a member of the first-generation K-pop group called Sugar. Eventually, she left the group to focus on her solo career, but fans believed there was more to the story. There were rumors that she left the group because she wasn't on good terms with Ayumi, the most popular member of the group. Previously, jong Um mentioned that the group was mockingly referred to as Ayumi and the Kids, a nickname that deeply angered her. Ayumi eventually acknowledged the rumored conflict with jong Um. While not denying the existence of negative feelings between them back then, she explained that during her active days as an idol, her tightly packed schedule left no room for personal matters, not allowing her to dwell on any issues with jong Um. She made sure to assure fans that they were on good terms after jong Um left the group, but she admitted there was definitely some rivalry present. Once jong Um tied the knot to young Don, things stayed stable for a while. At one point, though, their rose-colored glasses fell off because on February 22nd of this year, jong Um's label confirmed earlier rumors that she's filing for divorce from her husband. Media outlets had previously reported that she had recently submitted divorce papers to the court, and it turns out that it was actually true. Although getting a divorce is not that unusual nowadays, the controversial part is that it's happening for the second time now, as she has attempted to divorce the man a few years ago already. After she got married to Young Don, the two were on cloud nine, until jong Um surprised the world by making a shocking announcement in 2020. In September of that year, her agency revealed that she had filed for divorce. They made sure not to share any details with the public, leaving all her fans at a loss for words. It was never disclosed what moved jong Um to file for the divorce, but there's no denying that she and her husband were going through a rough patch. While everyone thought she and her husband were old news, she once again took the public by surprise when she reconciled with her husband a year after filing for the divorce. Elaborating on their reunion, her agency wrote that the two have understood each other's difficulties during the divorce process and decided to continue the relationship after an in-depth conversation. The pair even went on a second honeymoon to fully heal whatever was previously broken in their marriage. You'd probably think that the faint, lingering feelings they had for each other kept them together, but it was actually because jong Um was pregnant with their second child. Instead of going through with the divorce, she decided to call it off, probably to keep raising their children together. Only two years after her reunion with young Don, she went on SBS's talk show, My Little Old Boy, to explain why her marriage was the biggest regret of her life. In the episode, she opened up about her rocky relationship 
relationship with her husband and even revealed all the details of her first attempt to divorce him. She explained that when they first got together, she thought everything about him was so cool, but that it was because she was blinded by love. Elaborating on this, she said that she no longer finds him handsome and that she doesn't get excited about him. What really shocked the public, though, was her next words, which were, in fact, marriage is my life's biggest regret. Isn't it interesting that I like nothing about him? Although this sounds incredibly harsh, it seems like her husband wasn't all that nice either. She revealed that he, too, had a change of heart when it came to her because he no longer called her a doll for her beauty, but instead he called her a demon doll. Jong Um's comment alone made netizens' jaws drop, but then she continued by talking about how taken aback she was by her parents' reaction when she told them she had filed for divorce. She said, I revealed the news in my family's group chat, but I was shocked when I saw that my parents were only worried about my husband. Despite her worrying the public with these incredibly concerning revelations, she also shared that she and Young Don overcame their differences. Explaining this, she said, My husband now is careful not to do the things I hate. I guess we got back together because I still have some feelings for him. Well, that didn't last long at all because now they're calling it quits for real this time. No amount of counseling and improved communication could make up for the lack of love they had left for each other. In an announcement on February 22nd of this year, her agency wrote, After a lot of deliberation, Huang Zhang Um decided it's no longer possible to maintain her marriage and is in the process of filing for divorce. They made sure to keep a tight lid on any information about the divorce as they stated it's a personal matter they can't disclose too many details about. Despite this, media outlets have been doing some digging and have allegedly contacted a source close to Zhang Um. According to this person, Young Don was responsible for ruining their relationship, but it wasn't revealed why. Zhang Um took matters into her own hands when she made an incredibly shady post on her Instagram. She uploaded a picture of her husband holding one of their children and really came for him with the caption. She wrote, What a beautiful and considerate husband you were. This is my husband, Lee Young Don, who had so much fun and kept himself so busy while being married to me. Now you are free to go and enjoy. This doesn't sound like the most sincere or heartfelt comment in the slightest, and she actually posted the photo a few days before announcing their divorce. If anything, it seems like he was busy with other people while they were married. Jong Um then went on to confirm her husband's infidelity in the comment section. A netizen was surprised she posted his face and commented, so this is what he looks like. Shockingly, Jong Um then responded with, he looks like someone you'd have a hard time remembering, and if I remember, I think he dated like 400 people. As you can see, these comments clearly hint at real trouble in their relationship. So the divorce does not come as that big of a surprise after all. By now, it's clear that Jong Um isn't afraid to get public once she has an issue with someone. While some may think she has a cool and honest personality, others believe her outspokenness attracts a lot of judgment, which isn't good for her career. Considering she's been doing pretty good so far when it comes to her professional life, her forwardness isn't a big issue. We'll see if that changes once her divorce to Young Don is finalized.